So whenever the Matrix demo came out, I think last week, a couple weeks back, the interest on Unreal Engine 5 pretty much skyrocketed. So in this video, I'm gonna be taking a look at another UE5 demo that you can get for free in the Steam. Now, this is called the Market of Light. Now this released, I think back in September, but whenever I made that video last night in Final Fantasy VII, I am going to be showing you what I was kind of talking about when I said, you know, you can use some of these assets in UE5 and it looks good. It's going to look really good. Uh, hopefully I can show you that. And it's really going to show you a little bit of uh, a glimpse of what future games are going to look like whenever you're using Unreal Engine 5. And especially Mass Effect right now, by the way, if you're an Unreal Engine enthusiast or a freelancer, they're actually looking at talent right now because they are going to make the new Mass Effect in Unreal Engine 5. So make sure you check out the website and apply because you might actually be able to work on that game. So that being said, let's go ahead and get started. Please press any key to start. Now, I don't know if these Quixel Mega Scans on these assets, but I can just tell you right now that they look absolutely beautiful. And it looks like I think this might even be just high definition. I am capturing it in 4K using uh, Elgato Cam Link. So, yeah, let's walk around here. All right, space is turbo. I mean, if you've seen a lot of ArcVis kind of videos about. In Unreal, you can kind of see this already. This is pretty realistic here. And again, we talked about it last night playing Final Fantasy VII. You know, as far as furniture. It's really nice. This actually might be you know, photogrammetry, this entire scene. But I could be wrong. I mean, it just looks really freaking good. Now we got a cut scene here. It looks so vibrant, you know? Running on RTX 3090, we're gonna get a pretty nice 60 frames per second here. Looks like it's using 13 gigs of my VRAM. It's about 67 utilization. All right, so yeah, this is a mini game, but we'll check out the environment a little bit more. Yeah, it's gotta be photogrammetry, man. There's just no way. I'm trying to see if we can kind of fly closer to these pairs right here. That's <laughs> so cool. Some carrots up there. happens does it have collision in it oh no that's so cool our kids are gonna be so spoiled playing in graphics like this when they grow up uh, some onions this is definitely a European town I miss Europe man this is Making me even miss it more. <laughs> Some sunflower. Lemons. Alright, let's go ahead and collect whatever it is telling us to collect. So maybe we can progress here. It's not a big demo at all. Collect white orbs. Oh, I totally jacked that up. That was not a white orb. Wasn't even paying attention. Oh, maybe that is a white orb. Yeah, it's just surrounded by color. Yeah, that's a white orb. Got one underneath here. All right. 
looks like there's one right there get the red orb okay I guess this is a game to test your color see if you know your colors which you clearly don't is it up here oh no oh, what's going on with the clouds there huh interesting wonder if those are volumetric cloud for the Unreal Engine 5 or it could be just like a video of the cloud projected. Interesting. All right, let's grab this red orb. Oh, oh. That is broccoli. It looks so delicious. Psych. So real. Whoa, that looks wicked. Ah, all right. So he just wanted us to go get the red one like this, I guess. Okay, so let's go collect some more. Oh, this is cool. Some water here. I mean, the controls could have been better. This is really hard to control. I think a simple WASD would have worked here. <laughs> Missed it. Wow. Imagine like Counter Strike in this kind of graphics here. First one right there. Aw, oh, dude. Pastries, European pastries. Can't be doing this to me now. Oh man, I would eat that. <laughs> this is awesome, man. Got one underneath there. some gelato man okay it's gonna make us land again yep of course you're gonna put me right in front of a croissant it's messed up This bug is in paradise right now. It looks like an adaptive field looks pretty good. Alright, show off some of that dynamic lighting, right? It's pretty cool. Show you the night time now. This is pretty. Not very good at f finding games, so I'm probably gonna have to cut this video down if it takes me a while to find these stuff. Okay, what's going on? Blue. 
purple, whatever. Oh, blue. I was right. Whoa, now you're gonna speed up? That's weird. This is so pretty. Oh, wow, this is nice. Oh man, it's really pretty. You just don't have shadows for the bug. Somebody make a horror game in Unreal Engine 5 already. So we can really see who the tough YouTubers are. RGB Head at the top of the fountain. I think we're almost done here, yo. I wonder how long it took for them to make this demo. Alright, so that is the Market of Light demo that you can get for free in Steam. Go check it out if you want to benchmark your computer a little bit to see if it's ready for Unreal Engine 5. Uh, the RTX 3090 obviously didn't have any issues. And I am also recording this on another computer, so I wasn't using the RTX 3090 to record the actual gameplay. But yeah, if you all have any questions, let me know. And again, thanks for watching.